social networking sites. Great, aren't they? Allowing me, allowing you to stay in contact with all your friends, all your family, all your loved ones. We spend a lot of time on these sites. We spend a lot of time on our profile, trying to get it just right. Choosing the right photos, choosing the right things to say, choosing the right pictures to tag. We are very concerned with how we present ourselves to the rest of the world. In fact, the question of who am I, who are you, can often be answered by looking at our profile. The way we present ourselves is often a reflection of how we see ourselves. The problem is that too often we allow the negative thoughts we have of ourselves, the negative things other people say about us, to shape how we then present ourselves to the rest of the world. We allow negativity in general to affect and to decide on the way in which we choose to present ourselves. For me personally, I believe that there is another place we can look to to help us to form a positive self-image. And that place is the Bible, the scriptures, the holy word of God. Jeremiah chapter 1 verses 4 to 8 Now the word of the Lord came to me saying, Before I formed you in the womb, I knew you. And before you were born, I consecrated you. I appointed you a prophet to the nations. Then I said, Ah, Lord God, behold, I do not know how to speak, for I am only a youth. But the Lord said to me, Do not say, I am only a youth. For to all to whom I send you, you shall go. And whatever I command you, you shall speak. Do not be afraid of them, for I am with you to deliver you, declared the Lord. So the scripture clearly shows us that we were created with a plan and with a purpose. And although the media and society might tell us that as young people we have no purpose, that we are hooligans and we are good for nothing, the scripture shows us something different. It tells us that we were created with a purpose and with a plan. Ephesians 2 verse 10 goes on to say that this purpose was to do good things. Ephesians chapter 2 verse 10 For we are his workmanship, created in Christ Jesus for good works, which God prepares beforehand that we shall walk with him. And the reality is, if we want to know if we are living out our purpose for our lives, we need to see if we are doing good things.